All right. <clears throat> Here we are. Round two of Dark Cloud 2. <clears throat> you know, I think the last stream, uh, last time I did this, five hours was the longest I've ever actually consecutively streamed something. It'd be cool if I could do it again. Can't say whether or not I can, um, but it would be nice. 148. Start at 148, 5 apps, 648. That's the goal? Great. We'll see what happens. Gonna turn that down just a smidge. Yeah, that should be much better. Alright, <clears throat> where were we? Alright, um... I think... I'm pretty much set to go. I think last time I hopped on, I, I did some, uh... Did a little background work. Um... Yeah, I think we should be okay. Definitely have a scoop I have to get on this floor. That'll be interesting. Yeah, the last, last time I played, I played a level... I played for like 20 minutes that I didn't stream. I'm trying to do consistent streaming. I want it to... Uh, and I want to export everything to YouTube, so hopefully... Um, people can go back and watch the entire game played through. Because I don't think... At least I haven't found an actual playthrough of Dark Cloud 2. Which is a shame. It's super cool. And after a while, I think maybe uh, I might be the person to do that. We'll see, though. Time will tell. There we go. Yes. Alright, um... You know, it's funny, I played this for five hours yesterday, you think I'd know what the hell I'm supposed to be doing, but I really don't. I do not remember at all. Alright. A little bit of research to do real quick. Now, see, I played Dark Cloud 2 way back in the day. When I talked about this in my last stream. Um... It was super fun, and I actually have my old strategy guide from it, which I highly fucking recommend if you're ever going to play Dark Cloud 2 seriously, because there's a lot of shit here. There's a lot of content in this game, and if you want to get through it in any kind of timely manner, in a smart manner, um, a strategy guide certainly can't hurt. Yeah. Lightning and Beast going for that one. So the upgrade to the smash wrench that I'm trying to get is the stinger wrench, right? So to distinguish which one is the stinger and which one is some other bullshit wrench that I don't want, or hammer, or what have you. 27 beast. I need a boatload of lightning, so I'm about to waste my three synth points on, on lightning shit. <sighs> Alright. I think I need 40 lightning to get the stinger wrench. How nuts is that? Um, yeah, I'm just gonna go. Fuck it. I got the camera, so I need to get that scoop. I can snag it. See, what I want him to do is I want him to yell. It looks like he's yelling. So, the advice that I've been given is basically just wait until he does it. 
wait until he howls, and then snag a picture, so. That's the plan. Patience is a virtue, guys. Oh shit. What sucks is... I don't even think I've ever seen one of these things yell, so even when he does it, I'm not going to be ready for it. I mean, I have my finger on square, but... It... Hmm. This is exciting. Got it! That was easy. Took a while, but got there. Ooh. I'm trying to level up my gun because my wrench is already really good and I want my gun to be equivalent. I know that pretty much can't happen because the whole point of the gun is that you don't have to get up close and therefore you can do damage from far away, which is why you do less, but... Shit, did not want to kill him. Not with the wrench, anyway. Now, I'm thinking today might be when I go back and run the... Nah, I'm not going to run the sewers again. I'm going to wait till I get Speeda. And then I'll go back and run the sewers. And... I gotta go get all those scoops. Fuck me. I gotta go get all those scoops. And... Oh shit! I figured I would kill him for sure. Um, yeah, I gotta get all the scoops in the sewers and, you know, metals and shit, so I probably need to go run them again and just. I know it's not gonna be exciting to watch in the stream, me rolling through it twice, like it sucks, you know, so. I don't know. I'm a grinder though, always have been, I love grinding. Grinding is super fun. Okay. Didn't think that was going to work. All right. Worth it, I think? Probably not. I hate those fucking chests. I really do. You're always going to pay for it, whatever it is. Damn. Close, but no cigar. Eleven flour. I can make bread. Really not getting good XP for my gun. Shoot. I just make a whole level to level it up.
go. Now we're cooking with gas. See, the problem with the, uh, the idea of putting the stream on YouTube, uh, the one thing I didn't really think about is that I definitely stream for five hours, and if I keep doing five hour chunks of this game, it's going to make for really long bits that nobody is going to want to watch. But at the same time, splitting it into 15 minute segments is stupid too, you know? Like, where's that going to get me? Nowhere. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it. Damn! So close and yet so far. I leveled my wrench like crazy, man. Can't get away from it. Lightning. Uh, in case you're curious, in case you don't know, um, the reason I have um, so many night boots, um, and if you're if if you're somebody who played Dark Cloud Two a lot in the day, um, like I did, you might know this. Um, but it's a fun fact: if you synthesize night boots, spectrumized night boots, they're good for attack. Protector crystals, I think, are the hardest crystals to find in the game. Power crystals. Um, and, you know, those level up attack. But normally, the only way to really level up attack is to level up. Or use these. Night boots, for some reason, unbeknownst to me, are incredibly simple to make. They take almost... The, the materials are really easy. You can get the you can get the pictures as soon as you get to Sundane to make the invention. And they they level up attack. Like, the only downside to them is that they take up inventory space. But, I mean, you get so much inventory space, it, it's really alright. So, I don't know. That's... That's the reason that's like that, so, in case you're curious. Yep, I need a bunch more lightning, good lord. 40 lightning? How come nuts is that? Thought I picked up that rock? Definitely did not. Oof. Got him. This is a game where I thought about... You know, obviously I'm going to be playing this for a long time. There's a lot of content here. I mean, understandably... Ooh, shit! I cannot guard against that. Good to know. I'm going to get the fuck out of here, then. Not mean to do that. Uh... Okay. Makes sense. The level's called Killer Snake, but still. start to see lightning popping up when I'm doing damage because my lightning stat is so so beefed. Kind of cool. Beefed. Buffed. The word is buffed. Oh fuck. I was like a guard just at the right time. It slammed. Uh-huh. Ever to level up the gun. Ugh. It's 
probably indicative that I should stop trying to level it and level my my wrench, but like my wrench is so much more powerful, it's nuts. Which shall it be? Very yep. good. Here you are. Damn. Well, that'll be great for fishing later. Cause that'll happen. I should probably be sinking points into durability. Good god, it, I'm just blowing through these things. Even though my durability is not that much better than the wrench. I don't know. Bullets just cost one, I think that's just kind of the way it is. Maybe if you get your durability high enough to take two, but... Not even close. Pretty sure I have to have like 21 or 23 or something nuts right there. I could be sinking points new attack, but it's like... I get attack as I, as I get synthesis points, so I might as well spend it on other stuff. That's my thinking anyway. It's not perfect, but damn it, it's mine. I really do wish I could be one of those streamers who has like... Oh shit. A very, like, illustrious... Uh, audience who gets on chat, so I have like a thousand people that I can just talk to whenever I feel like, shit, about to die. Um, you know, a bunch of people that I can just like respond to. I can just shut the fuck up and let, let things happen, and that's okay. <laughs> you know, like I watch streamers like Cosmo, and I'm just like, dude, that must be so nice. You really don't have to say any of your own commentary. You don't have to come up with anything. You can just sit back and like let it happen for you organically. Spent a lot of bread on this one. Lots of bread. I think a great dungeon is Balance Valley. Good stuff, man. I'm not a huge fan of the forest. It's just the way I am, but Balance Valley is some top-notch shit. Really. Balance Valley is awesome. But Balance Valley, for those of you who don't know, is the following dungeon. That's what's going to come up next. It's where you learn Svita. There's lots of levels, man. Like, it's just good stuff. It's when the training wheels finally kind of come off. It's fun. Let's see. Hmm. Weird. Well, the game is kind of telling me to stop running dungeons and go do other stuff. I don't really want to do that now. I could, um, but I want to keep playing. So what happens if I keep going? Hmm. Not a whole lot. Looks like I can just keep going, and that's okay. Yeah, all right. I just saved, didn't I? Yeah, I did. It's cool. I can look at the stream and see that I saved. It's kind of nice. Don't get me wrong, the things you do outside of the dungeons are fun and challenging, I just don't think they're going to be that interesting for people to watch, and I hate to have to title this stream like, you know, running around and getting bullshit side characters, instead of like, running dungeons, you know, the things people really remember about this game. Don't get me wrong, the, the game is phenomenally memorable, but it's... I don't know. Plus I just have a lot more fun, actually, 
running dungeons as opposed to running around getting people. Because, like I said, I'm a grinder. I'm the kind of dude that, like, if I have to go get one person, I'm going to go get as many people as I possibly can in one shot. Oh, sweet of you. I had full health anyway, but thanks, Angel. Grotesque Spider Lady. Is that poison? Oh, you healed yourself, you bitch. See, now I'm doing lots of damage. That's nice. for days over here, good lord. Uh oh, this fucking guy. Well, that wasn't such a chore, now was it? I suddenly feel like my gun's doing a lot more damage. I don't know, maybe I, uh... Maybe those three smash crystals really helped me out. Or maybe just the enemies on this level are very weak to guns. I don't know. I don't even remember these fucking things. Look at this. Uh, yeah. What's stamina drink to? Oh. Ability boost. I, all right, that's cool. <laughs> Gonna take the long way. I didn't even give him time to fire. I like it. I can get on board with it. Another slash branch. Branch. <laughs> Another slash branch. Thank you. Pronunciation is hard. You'd think I work in goddamn radio, I'd be good at it, but nope, I'm, I'm pretty stupid. Also related to why I work in radio. You know what really sucked about the forest is playing Speeda on it, because you can so easily hit it out of bounds. It sucks. I mean, you can also hit it inbounds, you can hit it, like, if you get lucky, you can hit it in between forest stuff, which is cool, but at the same time, it's very much based on luck. That is not the item I needed. That was incorrect, I'm sorry. Scroll down, there it is. That is a really simple level layout. Oh, damn, there's one King Mimic on this map? That sucks. Gotta be one of these three chests. It's handy. Cool. 
Thank you, that was actually nice. Like, health is cool, but bread is simple, man. Oh, I literally got down to the last chest. It would really suck if I didn't know that was, this, this was a King Mimic. Done and done. There it is. That's the ticket. Well, I can do the next one if I really want. Mm. Yeah, fuck it. I might as well do it all in here. That way the only thing I have left is the, uh, the actual boss. So I can go do a bunch of other Giorama crap and I don't feel too bad. Wow, nice! I got a medal for finishing without healing. Didn't even know I did that. That was cool. White seal? What was a white seal? I guess I'm gonna find out. Can't remember. Yeah, well, Max is on the level, so that's good. Oh, God. This is a boss battle in itself. Can't heal, that sucks. That is handy. Definitely gonna save that angel coin till very close to the end because it could half my health, which would suck. Also could full heal me. There's a number of options there. Paint. Great. Uh, yeah, I got this one. Easy enough. No mimics on this one. Thank God. Three sonic boomers, though, and I have three big bombs, so that's actually kind of convenient in a way. scale. Pour some more into Smash here. Oof. 
Kind of a little close. Alright, cool. Well, I have an out if I need it. Which is good. I don't think I have a slash branch yet. Wide pod fuel, handy. Oh, I do, son of a son of a gun. Whoops, that sucked. Must have been just outside the hitbox for that thing. Dang, that was my last bomb. Now I'm gonna have to use the ride pod. Crap, I hate using the ride pod. It sucks. Wow, I did actually get the item from that. I was like, well, there's an item there, I'm not gonna get it. And I did, that was cool. <sighs> Alright. Did it again, son of a gun. Might try fishing at the end of this just for money. There's a lot of big open bodies of water on this level, so. And I'm desperate, so. go run and look, but I'm better than that. Exploration is key, but I don't know. I don't know where I was going with that. Oh, of course. Oh, come on! I didn't even knock him out! Yeah, I think I'll burn that angel coin. I only got a couple, couple enemies left. It, if anything, it, it, well, if it harms me, it only halves my health from 13 to what six? I would say seven, but I imagine this game rounds down. So, sweet. Oh, well, I'm gonna board with that too. It's always helpful. Oh, cool. I got the L3, R3 uh, shortcuts working. Awesome. That will actually save me some time. When I uh, started playing yesterday, I didn't have it set up. And that, uh, I just, I don't know, I forgot to assign the keys, and that sucked. Uh-oh. Oh, missed the last shot. What a, what a crime. <sighs> Did it though. No healing. Mm -hmm. Alright, that takes care of you guys. Let's see, has the seal been lifted? Yes. Oh, should have just waited. Oh, you tease! 
That sucked. These are... Ah, I should have waited. That was dumb. Crap. That's a waste. It's an outright waste. Mm. Should I go fishing? You know what? Yeah, I'll go fishing. I need the money anyway. So, I might as well try to get a, uh, a challenge complete while I'm here. Um... Yeah, this will be fine. Yeah, yeah this will be good. Alright. Um, I'm gonna throw that on there. I don't know if it'll work, but... <laughs> it sucks, I can never get the carrot to work, man. And I always have a bunch of those. Mmm, pretty small. Like for me, all fish sell for the exact same amount. I know, selling fish, what a crime, right? Wanna get an aquarium! Or grill! Because I. There's a piece of shit, I don't know. Whoops, don't have anything on the line. That would be a problem. Um, yeah, I care. Oh, I didn't even see these. Yeah, the minimum uh, fish goal is 68 centimeters or more, so. Pretty far off. That was 42, not great. Mm, pretty small. Slightly bigger than the last one, but... What should I put points in? Honestly, luck is probably where I should be sinking them. I don't know. That was weird. Done. Yeah, there we go. The theory is that if you up luck, then you'll get better fish, but even that's not... That's not concrete. Like, I feel like I've gotten slightly better fish since I started upping my luck skill, but not a lot. Yeah, like, this is the same, it's gonna be the same size as those other ones. Not huge. Uh, fishing's fun though. It's just, it's a grind. That's kind of everything in this game, but fishing in this case really is. You have to grind your fishing, <laughs> your fishing skills.
Maybe a little bigger. Probably not. It's probably. Oh, well, maybe. I doubt 68. Probably just like 60 if I'm lucky. I bet this is in the 50s. Low 50s. I've been putting points in grip, and I don't know why. Like, what's the point, you know? It's interesting you can get all your skills to 100. It makes me wonder if you have luck at 100, what happens. You always get awesome fish. Oh shit, this might actually be a big one. Oof, yeah, this is a big one. I don't know if it's 68 centimeters big, but this is the biggest one so far. It's these kind of fish that make me think I should start upping strength and line and that kind of thing. Oh, 67! God damn it! Oh, what a crime. Oh, it sucks. Try these, and I don't even know if these will work. Oh, Jesus. This has got to be the smallest fish in the world. Look at that. Just, <laughs> that was nothing. <laughs> Good lord. I probably should get a fish tank. And just, yeah, put the big ones in there. That probably couldn't hurt. I'm probably not going to entertain the fish racing, because I think that's really stupid, but... Maybe, I don't know. I want to play this game to the fullest. Also a small fish. I'm gonna go... 48 centimeters, that's my guess. Oh, 52. Not bad. Like I said, I don't think anything will bite on the carrot, but I'll give it a shot. Last time I did this, I sat here for, a, I'd say, a pretty long time. I mean, it's in the stream. It's in the. It's in the live stream. You can go back and watch it. Really, it's. I sat there for probably about three minutes. Okay, maybe not that long, but it felt like a long time. Carrot socks, dude. Nobody bites, but. Yeah, I don't uh, think the fish are biting today. Fuck it. 
I'm gonna level up my shit, and then we'll be on our way. Um... Let's get out of here. Alright. What is to follow is going to be... I would say a lot of not playing dungeons, which sucks. I know. I'm... I'm gonna enjoy it because I'm playing, but as a viewer, I wouldn't expect you to enjoy it. Maybe you will. Maybe that's a part of the game that... You want to feel nostalgic about it that you can't get anywhere else, and this is going to be it, and that's great, and I'm glad I can provide that for you. But for everybody else who's not familiar with this, you're probably not going to enjoy this. Just giving you a heads up. Fair warning. If you want to skip ahead, go nuts. If you're watching this live, real sorry. Alright. First things first, bombs. Do some Giorama shit, I guess. try to explain what I'm doing as much as I can so I don't just leave you guys in the black. So let's start out simple. Eric gives you bombs. Um, the bombs recycle every, uh, once per day and you get uh, six improved bombs. There. Um, just great. Right there. Awesome. They're fantastic. They work great for a multitude of bosses and shit. Uh, they're good. Um... I won't sell it. Sell stuff. Yeah, I'll see what I need. Um, so yeah. Now a great, I think a smart move is whenever you're out here, um, whenever you have to run out or for whatever, swing by, get the bombs. Because even if you don't use the bombs, the six improved bombs sell for 900 gilda, which is awesome. Um, in this game, money I would say is fairly important. Um, it's a good thing to have. Um, Bornea, on the other hand, uh, doesn't actually give you anything, but he boosts your possibility of item acquisition from monsters, um, which is good, because then you can sell all that extra crap again for money, so. Yeah. Yeah, I definitely have some things to do. Hmm. Let's see. I know what I must do. Here's what's gotta happen. I'm gonna make a straw house. I'm gonna go get Gordon, Max's gardener, which I have to give him one holy water to get him. Um, there it is. Son of a bitch. Two rolling rock, two rolling rocks, eight bundles ahead. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go get Gordon, put him in the house, go to the future, get some shit, come back, and then I can go get support characters. And that is when I will start basically harvesting support. 
Yeah, see? Yeah, they're... Oh, I know. Let's go get Gordon. He'll be perfect. He's our gardener. He knows all about trees. The guy's so clever. Go back to Palm Brinks and get Gordon. Yeah, sorry. Figured I'd save the trouble. Normally I watch all that stuff so, you know, whoever can experience it in full, but this time I just wasn't feeling it. <sighs> Mostly because I just said exactly what they told you. Told me. Told us. Together. This is a group event. Sorry, I had a drink of water. I had to maintain sustenance. Uh, two rolling rocks, eight what? Shit, I didn't... I wasn't paying attention. Bells hay. It's gotta be. Yeah, straw house. It's gotta be bells hay. That makes sense. Um, two... And... Eight of those. Oh, I should have sold him my fish. Damn. It's sad that going into the menu and doing that was probably faster than me actually walking. Rough rock. Fuck, I had plenty of rolling logs. Damn. Well, on the flip side, this time I can actually sell my fish and all that crap. I think we're good. My little money. Wait, where am I going? Jesus. It's right here. Jogged right by it. I gotta be honest, I'm a little out of it. I'm kinda tired. It's been a long day. It's Monday, after all. First day back at school, August 25th. Yes. Okay. Hmm. Don't know where to put this. I gotta put it somewhere. It's gotta happen. Hmm. Ooh, wasn't there something about building a fence around the Furbit's place? Create a fence around the Furbit's house. Yep, and then place five trees. Yeah. So I am running a little behind. Hmm. Alright. Five trees and a fence around the Furbs place. Great. I guess thorn trees don't count, do they? It's fruit trees. Thorn tree. Eye trees. I guess thorn trees are going to count. Great. Um, I need a bunch of 
fence, don't I? Rough wooden fence. Ten might do it. Um, rough wooden fence, that's the first thing. I need it around the Furbit's place, so... Uh, yeah, 10 definitely did not do it for me. Gonna need a little bit more. <laughs> and I don't have any more. Gonna go buy rolling logs. I'll be right back. This is the one thing that sucks about you, Rome. You're constantly missing out. That'll be enough for now, I guess. I think where I'm gonna put that straw house. I mean, I don't, I, it really doesn't matter. You can kind of put shit wherever you want, but still, it's disconcerting. I have options. I'm not. I'm not a savage. I played The Sims once. I don't know if I need ten, or just like, like six will do it. Save on paper. Damn. Yeah. Ten. Six definitely did not do it. You're gonna need some more. Uh, five more. I guess I can break things apart if I don't have enough, can I? Forgot about that. Uh, I'm up there. There's not bad. Can you break things apart? I don't think you can. I thought you could, but I'm an idiot and I probably can't. Hmm. Well, hmm. Uh, which culture do I have? Ten, ten whole culture points. Great. I got a gate. Oh, wooden gate. There you go. Probably need one of those. What do I need? Rolling logs! Shocking. Hmm. Should I put the house somewhere? That's fair. Trees around, because why the hell not? Gordon's a tree man, right? Right there. Oh, there it is. It's uh, a good one. Right. And one more somewhere. Wonderful. Nothing changed in the future? Fuck you guys. <laughs> um
Hmm. I guess we can go get Gordon. That's the next logical step. Brinks? Sure. I've got the holy water to give him, so that's good. That's one less thing I'm gonna have to worry about. And then while I'm over here, I might as well get a bunch of the other support characters, because I know they all... You gotta get them eventually, right? What's up? Max's dad is on bad terms with the priest? What the hell is that about? Oh. Actually, just want to give you some stuff. You need some holy water, right? Yeah. I can go with you on your adventure. Gordon, join my party. Shit, I probably actually should have read that part about putting them in your, uh, moving them somewhere. I think I, I think I remember how to do it, though. I think there's, like, a sign in front of the door, and that indicates that you can, um, yeah, that indicates that you can move them in, and then you just get where you want to move into that place. So, uh, I'm gonna go try the priest real, real quick, and if I can get him, then I'll go get a bunch of other characters. I think I have to move Gordon in first. I think that's like step one, and, and it kind of, uh, I guess you flip that invisible switch in the game and says, okay, now you can get some more characters. Be my friend. So I need to put all the candles out, right? Now I'm a moron, and I could spend a lot of time doing this. But we'll see. Maybe maybe I'll get lucky. Maybe we'll figure it out. That's good. That's bad. Uh huh. Okay. And I'm exactly back where I started. I know there's a simple solution to this. I've done it before. I just don't remember it. All right, <clears throat> let's go this way. Restart. Reset the candles. All right, got that. Um, that one. Okay, that's good. This one? Oh, no way. <laughs> wow, it was super simple. I'm a moron. Thanks, Priest Bruno. You're a peach. I'll see you on the bus, you dirty old man. <laughs> Alright, what's next? Um, This way, I guess.
Okay. I thought those were actual actual houses you could enter. I was blown away for a second. I was like, dude, I do not remember going into those in the game. <laughs> Did I really miss those after all these years? Whose place is this? Who are you? I don't actually know where this is. Oh, it's Donnie's place. Yeah, yeah, he and his dad live here. I remember because we're pumpkins. I can get you, though. Uh, okay. Oh, I gotta play hide and seek. That's right. I remember this one. Um, yeah, there she goes. Hmm. Okay. I got this. I know exactly how this is gonna go. <laughs> now, if I remember right, I know she shows up in Max's place. And I think she shows up in Claire's place, because I don't think she's in her house. Which is stupid, but I think that's the way it is. Let's go look. See, I don't remember how to actually look for her. Do I have to like walk up to something and press X? Or do I, uh... Is it going to be like very obvious where she is? Oh! Perfect. She doesn't really actually hide behind or in anything. She just goes somewhere and stands there. That makes it easy. Shout out to whoever's watching. I don't know who you are, but I appreciate your I, I appreciate your company, as it were. I couldn't have a better audience. Thanks. Really. And hey, if you like what you see, I think this is oh yeah, there she is. Um, I plan on this being a regular thing, playing through the whole game. So, um. Yeah, I just keep my username in mind. If you want to throw me a follow, that'd be cool. Because then you'll get one email every time I stream, and you'll just know. Like, oh, hey, he's on. I can watch. Um, or don't. I wouldn't blame you if you didn't. I'm pretty stupid. All right, cool. That's done. She's done, right? Yeah? All right, cool. Uh, Stuart! Goddamn butler, you're up next. What do you want? Thirty years working hard in this house. Uh, oh shit. I barely have a thousand. Oh, you motherfucker! you, man. I'll be back later. <laughs> you, you swindling son of a bitch. Golly. What does it take to please some people? <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. That is so unfair. I was like, what? I feel like a thousand. I'll do it if that's what it takes. Nope. <laughs> it does not take a thousand. It takes more. That is so crummy. Ah. Uh. Damn. What's Max Dad want? I want to build up this trumpet gun to a bell trigger. Uh, done. Wait, wait, wait. Does he keep my gun? Because if he keeps my gun, I'm not doing it. Let's see. Did you take my gun? No, I still have it. Alright, thank Christ. Then that was super easy. 
That was something I've already done. That's no trouble. Speaking of, that guy's got some huge guns. Good lord. I'm not talking about his arms. I mean, like, above the door. He's got, like, rifles mounted. It's nuts. You don't even see that kind of thing in this game. Other than the fox hunter guys. Will you join me? No. Alright, uh, the chef and the tailor. Need both of them. Granny Rosa, I think, actually will. Please enter the words, let's go together. Alright. Um, the pinnacle of, <laughs> of streaming uh, entertainment. Space. Whoops. Good. Wow. Really, the biggest challenge in this, the biggest puzzle, is fighting the god-awful keyboard controls. Alright, alright. Go. To. Get. Whoops. I, got, I just got overexcited. I think I can swap out a letter. Yep. Let's go together. Easy. Man, this getting people to follow you is nuts. Also incre damn. It's also incredibly simple. Ah, right, you son of a bitch. Come here. Roasted chestnuts. That's what he wants, right? I think. Yep. I remember this. I remember this because it took me forever back in the day. Because I had to just randomly find one, and I, I don't think I have one. Damn! Alright, well I'll be back for you later, my friend. Some of them are so simple. Like punching and let's go together, and others are like... <sighs> Get a roasted chestnut. Shit! Uh, yeah, there she is. Um... Uh, what do I have to give her? Sturdy cloth, thick... I think I actually have all of those. Maybe not sturdy cloth. Oh! Son of a gun. What am talking about? Sometimes things just work out. Uh, where'd she go? <laughs> am I retarded? Let's see. Um. Yep, does not tell me where she went. Oh, leave the room, come back, talk to her. Cool. I can do that. Man, there's. I don't think there's anywhere I can buy roasted chestnuts. I know I don't need that guy till Balance Valley, because I remember that. You set up like a food cart with him essentially, but. Um, still, it'd be nice to get them while I'm here. Saving the truck later. Green overalls. I might actually wear those. Thanks. Uh, let's see. Eh, not bad. I don't know. I'm a purist. I also like the color. This is a lot of green. You get a little blue, a little orange, that butterscotch. Kind of nice. I think there's something up here, but I can't remember. Uh, maybe? Post Constructor Rock. Cool. I will not remember that. Mm -hmm. There it is. Okay. Uh, what else? What else do I need? What else could I get? I have a lot of people to go. Pretty much the entire town of Palm Brinks. Hmm. Mayor Need, I think, is who I really used the last time through. He, uh, his bonus is he just gives you more money after defeating enemies. And you can exchange medals. And if you don't know what that means, that's okay, because I don't either. Yeah. Um, yeah, let's go. 
Uh, I don't think there's anybody else on this section of town. Oh, uh, Parn. I gotta get him. The artist. I don't actually know if he's in his place. Normally he's out in the street. Um, you just have to give him a bunch of paint. Either way, dude, man, this guy's cool. Look at him. His character design makes him look like he'd be a side character in like Final Fantasy IX. I mean, he's a little tall, but you, you get what I mean, right? The hat, paintbrushes, like he looks cool. Oh, well, that's ironic. You get the golden eggs. Um, I'm gonna get that here in, in like a couple of minutes, and I guess I'll come back and get him. So maybe I'll maybe I'll stumble across a roasted chestnut on the way. No, the golden eggs are in the future, uh, in with Jurak and stuff. They're up in a tree. You take a picture; it's for a scoop. Um, I guess yeah, I'll get those soon. Got disoriented for a second. We're back on track though. <sighs> oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. I always thought it was weird how the camera tilts down like this when you run. I assumed it was loading the next area, but it's really kind of obnoxious in a way. But I don't mind it, but at the same time, I, one of the things I love about this game is the ability to see the scenery, you know, the things up on the horizon that you kind of can now. But you don't get that. You get that one specific part for no reason. It's kind of strange. I don't think you can help me. Yeah, no. Do the uh, joggy jog around the lake. Whoop. This guy, I think I either have to like I have to fish. Or I have to like come back at night. Yeah. Oh damn. Catch a nonkey of more than sixty Well, I don't have any bait, so that is not gonna happen, because I pretty much sold it all. Let's see if I can get a couple of uh, tips from the old walkthrough. What's his name? Fabio. Um. Yeah, if he's a prickly in the fish, fish monster swamp, I can do it. Don't know where I can get one of those, but I suppose I'll figure it out. This guy. I think I have to come back in the night or something. Yeah. come back at night. Oh, show him a picture of the moon. Well, I don't have one with me, I don't think. And I'm batting a thousand right now. Oh. Definitely no picture of the moon. Damn. Mm. That sucks. Alright, so I gotta come back at night, I gotta catch, catch a 60-centimeter nonkey, I gotta get a roasted chestnut, I gotta... What else? I don't know, I can't think of the other ones. I think that's it. There's more. I gotta get the do list going now. Lord. And what is it you want? That was incredibly descriptive. Thanks! I have a lot of bugs in my feathers, and they make me itch terribly. I don't know what to do about that. Hmm. Oh, I can't get him until after the end of chapter two. That's right. Silly me. Um. Oh yeah, I gotta get 2,000 gold for the butler. That sucks, man. Come on, what do you think I am, Mr. Moneybags? Man, I know I live in, like, the biggest house in Palm Brinks, but, I mean, I'm not... <laughs> I'm just a kid. I couldn't even buy a ticket to Flotsam Circus. I had to get it off some jerk off the street. Huh. 
Maybe I should... I don't know. Alright. <clears throat> I know I can do the Sheriff Blinkhorn thing. That's a race. I remember that. You, you have to run somewhere and run back. Run to the boat at the lake and back. Two minutes, one second. Man, if I had a timer. Here we go. Oh, I do have a timer. That's convenient. Uh, why is the game lagging? I mean, lag's fine because if it's, you know, the timer runs slower too when that happens, but it would suck if it didn't. Something I remember when I was a kid uh, playing through this, if you don't get to the boat and hit X, you will not make it. This is the part where it sucks with cam camera tilt up, you can't see. I'm just blindly running and hoping I don't run into a tree and I'm actually like headed the right way. Oh, ran into an area. Crap. I guess we'll see if I can make it. Definitely did not make it. Not even close. I think the timer keeps going when you're in that dialogue box. That sucks, too. Yeah, it did. Oh, I can get a picture of the moon! Wherever it is. Aha! <laughs> well, I didn't get the one guy, but I got the other one, so I think that's worth it. Let's see if we can strategy to get back. A little practice scanner. Hold it on Twitch all the time. Yeah, not even close. I mean, I know I stopped and took a picture, and that was stupid, but... Whew. Ten seconds behind him. Um, yeah, I'll go. All right, here we go. It does suck that like they really. This is one of those cases in which the developer really did put it like is is. They, they, I swear to God, one of them ran it and said, "Well, let's see if they can beat that." Like, and it's still really hard. You gotta cut every corner. You're not gonna make it. Alright, doing better. Not much better, but better. Don't want to jinx myself. Kill for something faster. Yeah, I didn't get it. Alright. Nope. Took me took me too long to get here. Take me longer to get back. Even still, my time had to have been faster than my previous time, right? I mean, logically. It'd be rather upsetting if it wasn't.
three seconds. Alright, I'll give it another shot, and if I don't get it, then I'm gonna say, fuck it, and I'll do it sometime on my own. <laughs> yeah, here we go. <clears throat> A lag sucks, but I can't say I don't mind it, because at this point... I don't know, it doesn't, it doesn't make it any faster anyway. Wait, I can't say I don't mind it. What does that even mean? I do mind it. I, I mean, I do, but I don't. At this instant, it's not that big of a deal. Versus, like, being in a dungeon, where it would... You know, I, I need that to work. I feel like I'm retarded, and I'm taking the long way around to get to the boat, but, like, I really... I think this is the fastest, most efficient way I do. Nope, didn't make it. I got close. Come on, Max. You can do it. Yeah, I, I I figure if I look down and I'm like, like a minute 03 when I get to the boat, and there's no way I made it, because it's going to take me a minute 03 to get back, logically, right? Oh, good to know you can run in the grass a little bit. I thought I'd just cut you off. Huh. Good lord, I think my time might be worse than last time. I forgot I was doing better, but uh, at this point, maybe not. I got point oh one seconds slower. Um, no. Go fuck yourself, Blinkhorn. I don't need you. I'll see you around. What a dick. <laughs> I couldn't bring him, like, a roasted chestnut like the other guy. At least that I can actually, like, do something entertaining when I'm doing it. Races suck. There's not even, like, music for them. You're doomed from the start. I don't know where Claire is. But I'm just gonna go. Let's go do something exciting. I got a couple of peeps. They're cool. Oh, shit. I didn't get that Rufio kid. Whatever. I got the picture of the moon. It'll be fine. Um, what's next? So don't actually know. Oh, I gotta go put that fucking Gordon in the house. Good lord. Uh, move people in. Gordon. Get on your way. There's been a change in the future. Maybe something will happen. Perhaps. Um... Yeah, let's see what happens. Now there should be... Should be... Uh, Jurax Branch. If there's not, I'm gonna be pissed. Because I, I think I... Got that requirement. Maybe not. Definitely not Jurax Branch. Damn. That sucks. Kind of like the Deku tree, except with two nose holes instead of a mouth. <laughs> called Emperor Griffin. We suspect he's a terrible monster who's taken over the forces of darkness. Hmm. 
He's been playing with reality across the different eras. I don't know what his true goal is, but if we let him keep at it, the whole world may disappear. He even erased you, Jurak, by destroying your origin point. We've got to stop him, or there's no telling what will happen. Jurak, I hear you've been reincarnated many times, but you keep the memories of your ancestors from the distant past. Isn't that right? So somewhere in those vast memories, you should be able to remember everything that's ever happened on this planet. You must remember something about Griffin. Who he is, where he is. Griffin. Let's see. I'm afraid. I don't remember. I'm true. My memories must not all be back yet, I guess. <sighs> Damn. Should definitely be a branch with some eggs and a mushroom on it. That sucks. Defense. Defense. Um, I'm going to try talking to him again. Nope, nothing. Um, shit. Oh, hey, another box. Guess I'm going to have to go the old fashioned way. <clears throat> Gonna have to hop in and start figuring out what requirements I need. Wait, it's gonna change in the future. What, just now? Because I went there and came back? Is that what that is? Probably nothing. It was probably just some kind of crazy glitch or something, but I'm curious. Hey, got some music now. Oh, yeah, no. It's nothing. Shit. I just a lot of thinking. Butterfly. I've heard of it. He's heard of it. one nostril blows the seed out. <laughs> Plant hmm. that in the woods and a bud will grow. But it takes more than that for a flower to show. You need sun drops. Sun drops? They have the power to speed the growth of green things. Where can we get them? It's a kind of sap the monster Himara produces. You'll have to ask Ahimara. Hang on! Ask a monster? That's nuts! How can we talk to a monster? You must. 
must think of that yourselves. <laughs> Where'd that box come from? Hmm. Yeah, I got some work to do. Wow, more boxes. Shit. There have to be more over here, are there? Mm -hmm. I don't think so. Oh, I need to place five more trees. That's what it looks like. Yep, five more trees. Uh, thorn tree? I need three water elements. Can do. Whoops! Did it again! I'm telling you, I spawn on the map and I see that exclamation point and I, I panic. I gotta hit it. Three water elements is what it said. There's three characters I need. Two, I think. I need to get two people in. Yeah, two more. I need Aunt Polly and I need Melan. Aunt Polly is, you know, just that. She breaks, she bakes bread. She runs some shop. She's your aunt. Melan, however, smoking hot. Oof. Crunchy bread. Man, I love crunchy bread. It heals more than normal bread. It's awesome, and you, like, never get it. What's up, dick? I suppose I can take it to your house, Morton. Fucking asshole. Maybe I need to exercise. Maybe, maybe if I get a little bit more, I can actually make the time from the boat and back for Sheriff Blinkhorn. Sheriff Bloodhorn. God, what a dick. I hate that fucking guy. I'm sorry, that was a hacky joke. They can't all be winners, all right? Uh, yeah, it's this one. Cheese isn't thick enough. Okay. Now what? <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> uh... Alright, yeah, back to Morton's place. I had to guess. It was like between Ferdinand and Morton. I'm gonna guess I'm gonna go to Morton's place. And the guy agrees. I, I, again, if you if you ever plan on playing through Dark Cloud 2, which I still highly recommend, um, I also highly recommend a strategy guide because there's a lot of shit in this game that just isn't explained. And you have to figure it out. You'll spend a lot of time wandering around trying to figure it out. Cancelled. What a shame. Yeah, I'll take the bread back. 
God, this guy sucks. What's up, Aunt Polly? Rub dub dub. Thanks for the shit. Phenomenally inconsiderate. Wow, she gave me all twenty. That's awesome. Thanks, Aunt Polly. You're a peach. All right, all right. <clears throat> Come straighten up. As soon as those chicks awesome. This is a bit earlier at the beginning in one of the opening cutscenes where she's at the circus with the elephant and like her boobs actually bounce up and down. It's crazy cool. Be my friend. Yeah, see? Circus. It was pretty cool. You don't seem like you want to be my friend. Oh, I gotta be in control of Monica. <sighs> be my friend. So, she's gonna give me a Gladius. I have to level it twice. Crap, I really don't want to go do that. But I have to. Um... Yeah, this will be fine. I'm trying to think of where I can go to level a Gladius. I know what I'll do. Hop in here real quick. Get some more bombs. Pro tip. Always just go get more. Like, you might as well. It's really simple. Doesn't take a lot of time. And they're helpful. So Why is that there? Don't be there. Should be up here with all the other stuff. There. Um, shit, what was I going to do? Oh, bombs. Like I was saying earlier, bombs are great because one, they do a buttload of damage and they're absolutely free and two you can sell all six of them if you want for 900 gilda which is great in fact that's probably how i'm gonna end up getting steward i'm just gonna sell all those and i'll be on my way it's essentially free money and lots of free money it's nice uh gonna save real quick because i haven't done that in a while how long have i been playing since i last saved oof an hour nice um Using only Monarch's sword. Great. That way, hopefully, I can get a medal and level her sword at the same time. That is efficient gameplay. Thanks. I appreciate the comments, I do. And hey, seriously, thanks again for watching. I don't know how the. How the there's, there's, what, two of you? I don't know how the fuck you're putting up with me, but again, I appreciate it. It's probably for the love of the game. I remember in the original Dark Cloud, um, using, oh, wait, only Monica Sword, can't use anything else. In the original Dark Cloud, the, uh, Gladius was always a cool weapon. Because initially you just start out with, like, essentially a dagger, and you kind of work your way up, and the Gladius is always, like, the second, second up. It's always cool. That is a game that I also think is cool, but I will not stream because I have no patience for it. Because, I'll never forget the first time I was playing that, and... A weapon broke and I like lost my shit. I was like, that's seriously gone. I, I played with that thing for like. <laughs> I'm playing for two hours leveling up that weapon and like you break a weapon and it's gone forever. It's, it's incredibly unforgiving of you making just a simple mistake and not noticing the bar. And the bar is really small. It's a small section of your screen. It's easy to miss.
I don't remember how to get the um, Hamara monster badge, but I should definitely get that because if they're here, then I can two birds, one stone it. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna boldly assume that I don't know what to do there. Item. Check badges. Don't have any. Yeah, I don't remember what to do. I think you throw something at him to get to get him, but I can't remember. Well, the good news is the Gladius is leveling up, leveling up quick. One down. I didn't have a ton of night boots, I would think. Well, that's awesome, but again, I kind of... <laughs> I made a bunch because I thought, oh, well, I'm never going to find any anyway, and I have like three that I haven't even used yet, so... Joke on me, I guess. I don't know. I really don't want this weapon to break, but I also really don't want to have to spend any repair powder on it. How lazy is that? There we go. Awesome. Theoretically, now it's a Gladius plus two. Gladius plus two. Switch back to this, and I'm on my way. Kind of close, I guess. Definitely prefer the Night Sword. Just feels faster. I don't know. You'd think the Gladius is smaller, it'd be different, but I don't know. Hey, a prickly! Nice. Whoops. Didn't mean to hit Ride Pod Fuel. Could burn the whole forest down with it though, but that's probably not what I need for the spider web. Maybe I can catch a donkey. Out in the uh, Palm Brinks place. The lake. And then I can take Fabio and run. Oh shit. Something I have to be sure not to do is not to use any rocks or anything on these guys. Just super tempting because if you've seen any of the of my dungeon crawling in this game, I always use rocks because they're so simple and you get an item sometimes and you knock them out and you wail on them like rocks are awesome. They're really all the enemies in this section, didn't they?
I think that's it. Metal? Maybe? Sweet. I know you need like 60 medals to get anything even halfway cool from Mayor Need, but still. Medals are cool, man. They're kind of like achievements. I don't know. Another power crystal. Wow. I'm starting to think making all those night boots might have been premature. Exorcism is what I need to level. Let's see if I... Oh, God. Let's see if I can figure it out real quick. <clears throat> Let's see. I want her to get the Bastard Sword. I think. I want her to get the Broad Sword, which means I think I'm going to be leveling. Yeah, I think I'm going to be leveling. Yeah. Exorcism. <laughs> Don't mind me, just trying to zip through this because you guys are watching. I know you're incredibly bored. Monica Sword, Broadsword. It's the Bastard Sword. Where is the. Ah, Broadsword. Yep, Exorcism. I was right! Um, okay, need to have 19 Exorcism. So, right now I've got 4, 7, 10, 13, 16, 18. I have six. This is points. Perfect. That is a broad sword. Cyclone or flame? I don't know what I like more, the love or the five star armlet? I don't know. Uh, I'm gonna go for the bandit brass here because it sounds cool, so. Uh, Cyclone. Cyclone is what I need to level. A lot, actually. <laughs> Not even close. Uh, yeah, let's get out of here. Cool looking. <clears throat> 
Yeah, something I don't think I'll ever be using in this game is save states. Don't want to do it. I think, um... I don't know. I was saying uh, yesterday when I was playing this, um, I'm not a big fan of emulators. This is the first emulator I've played in years. I don't like them. They don't. They don't feel. Uh, I don't feel genuine. I don't know. Um, yeah, Palm Brink Station one, I think. And save states is definitely plays into that. I know a lot of people are playing like, oh yeah, just use save states. I'm like, this feels fake though. I don't know. It feels cheap. Oh, what the... It was definitely not all just talk. Thank you for implying that, though. What? Do I actually have to level it? Is that... Do I actually have to, like, build it up twice? Is that is that the implication here? If you can build up the Gladius twice. Damn it! Shoot! Cyclone and Beast. Crap. Alright. We're gonna get a long way then. Gladius goes to the Cliff Knife. What do I need for the Cliff Knife? Kitchen knife. There it is. 14 cyclone, 14 beast. So. One of those. Do I have. Hay, because I know hay synthesizes the cyclone. cyclone. I do not have any hay. Okay, I can go buy some. That's not a huge deal. Um. Beast. I got five, so that's eight, eleven, fourteen. Any wind elemental? Wind. Perfect. Save me some money and some hay. It does suck, I have to build it up twice though, seriously. What? Fuck. Really? Is this the one time it would've been stupid? Uh, I'm gonna go see, yeah, this one. I don't know what the difference is, but... Um... <laughs> Off the cliff knife, you get the chopper or the sandbreaker. Well, I want the chopper, because why not? So, chopper or sandbreaker? Let's go see. 